Master Ken here with a message for Urban Combat Frankfurt. Uh, Ralph was telling me that it's a self-defense system by Lee Morrison and that it has something to do with the Libre knife fighting system. I don't know. I wasn't really paying attention. But I went to your website and it turns out it's all in German. So uh, most people aren't going to be able to understand it because every other word is Spurgen Flergendergen. But just in case you need some actual real-life Ameridote self-defense that you can use in an urban situation, here's your quick lesson, okay? Now, in this day and age with the quarantine happening and everything, it's good to have your PPE, not only your gloves, but uh, your rag here. You know, if you don't have a, a mask, you can just sort of put a, put a rag over your mouth. That way you're protected, okay? Let's say you end up in a knife fight with... Uh, uh, a maskless individual who's violating the social distance. They're not staying six feet away. They come up to you, okay? First thing you want to do, you want to brandish the knife to let them know that you mean business and then cover their eyes with the mask. Insert right into the neck here. Uh, slice the carotid artery, okay? You can come back down and cut the throat. Then uh, the blood is going to be squirting out onto you. So you want to put the rag over the blood, and then stab right into the eyes, both eyes. You have to get both eyes, otherwise they're still going to be able to see you. If you stab them in one eye, they'll just keep fighting like this. But if you stab them in both eyes, not a threat, okay? Both eyes. And then uh, by then, he'll probably bleed out. And then you learn the dual function of the PPE. Because if you have gloves, no fingerprints, and at the end... Use the rag to clean off your weapon, and then just go back to protecting yourself. So, that's your lesson for today. Keep on training. I'm Master Ken, and remember, always restomp that groin.